sun. The sun is so hot. And I haven't eaten. I have not had any water. For days. Okay, melodramatic. But anyway, here is my latest creation. You see it out there in the horizon. Hmm. Looks, I think, I hope, like a Greek or Roman inspired temple with a wall around it. Let's have a closer look. Okay, seems like someone blew up some TNT here. Might have been me. Look at that. Plants and everything. So basically there is a spider monkey proof wall all the way around this thing I've built. Yeah, zombie safe entrance, double secured, and a couple of hard doors as well. And here we are. Look at that. Pens for animals. A well. crops, a place to live, we've got corn and potatoes down there, we've got blueberries, self-sufficient, look at that pathway and flowers and everything, a nice well here feeding the water into both the garden on the right and, and the fields on the left and the pens. So the rabbit pen in here, pig pen behind us. It doesn't hold the rabbits very well but you get the point. And there's the stack pen. So this whole building is self-sufficient with everything you could ever want and it even has a Japanese inspired garden. Not a big one but a garden nonetheless. Triple doors. Not that I think zombies will ever get in here. Walls, parapets, usual stuff. And look at that. Isn't that a nice view? It looks very calm and relaxed and harmonic and harmonic? Harmonious. So I took inspiration from Roman buildings in, in this building here. Some uh, sturdy stone as a foundation then burnt brick on top, some columns, an atrium in the entrance hall. I like water. And then on the first floor, the living quarters. A kitchen, and of course a big screen TV. Turns out you can't really open these closets without having your own inventory open. So there you are. Weapons, and more weapons, couch to relax in, a bed, fridge, lots of meat in there, an oven, and a cupboard. So that's what I've been spending my time on these days. A nice little farm, a homestead. And that's all for now, so enjoy yourselves and have a good new year.